Hi everyone, so this is 2022 and I'm going to unboxing here $2,200 laptop I'm getting here only in $200 and this laptop is only Six year before, okay. <clears throat> Let's open it. Now you can imagine two thousand two hundred dollar laptop. If you get after a few years only in $200 I think what a amazing deal right so now you can see what kind of laptop is this and there is a charger okay nothing more in the box okay so first we will see the charger here is the charger and you get the idea so now I'm going to open it. This is HP. G HP eight one zero G three and the good thing is here you can see it's slightly marks because it's slightly used but at least original not refurbished as you can see the condition is quite nice and the back side is a big battery here and Let's open. Okay. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, this is invoice. So I didn't get free. I know some people thinking maybe I get free. It's not like that. So let's open, turn on. On button is here. Okay, you can see. Wow, quite fast and you can count the second how many seconds it's turned on i don't know windows is installed or yeah this is bios still uh, i have to disable so speed will be faster actually the windows speed is really fast so yeah let's see the touch this is a quality you can see very smooth and let's see the scrolling smooth slightly my finger might be not touched but I'm but here yeah I feel very smooth yeah and let's see okay go to home and my computer mm, computer system property maybe I'm not very so here is the specification as you can see okay let it be more near yeah here you can see the specification simple and yeah this laptop I think 2014 and now almost six to seven year and quite solid two thousand two hundred dollar of course it will be much should be a good build quality 
because the cost of this device when new is very expensive. Hope you like the video. Thumbs up. Okay guys, so this is the update video. Uh, first thing I want to show you again. This computer specification here. I'm almost using more than three months. And now you see still the specification is same here. And if I go to the graphic card, here you can see the device manager. It's coming late because behind the game is loading actually. So here you can see the display is Intel HD graphic 550. So here is the graphic I'm using and the portable device here is a SSD 256 GB and Core i5 5 Gen. Okay, so okay guys, so this laptop called HP Revolve G3. I put it like a desktop actually. Uh, I put some uh, plastic here because so the dust will not go straight away from top to the inside and here you can see I put some hangers and here I connect the HDMI and you can see the same laptop here okay <clears throat> yeah so I make it as a desktop and I it's run almost all day almost three months and it's look like very solid because it costs almost two hundred dollar so now I want to show you how some games I want to show you some games here and okay here is the small Bluetooth <laughs> so okay the game is running here better with Battlefield 5 and okay here you can see it's loaded already loading and I'm going to play first I want to show you the setting setting is on the minimum here is the settings okay here is the setting all you can see in the advance all is low okay, go back back and I want to click on play and here is resume <coughs> so let's see okay go down again here here is resume and here is the frame rate you can see this is only the loading frame rate but once the game will start it will be different of course Okay. So uh, I'm using it as a desktop, and actually it can be t tablet mode also, and it's laptop also. So in two hundred dollar, I think it's a better than any mini desktop, PC, or a big desktop because you can take with you, and you can use as a tablet, and still that is laptop. So I think it's a best choice in two thousand twenty two or two thousand twenty three. This kind of laptop under two hundred actually it's the num now the price might be you can get less than two hundred dollar with 8 gb ram 256 gb ssd and the graphic is hd 5500 and core i5 and uh, there's a i7 also i7 uh, gen 5 also you can get it uh, okay so now the movie uh, sorry the game is loading still i don't know i just stalled the game and it's just after stall the first time uh, starting okay I'm going to pause and okay so now the loading is done okay so now the loading is done now you can see it's 12 13 frame but still like a playable It's not not playable but still can playable. Okay, I'm 
trying to go faster as you can see still playable of course the graphic is So almost 15 frame Almost the 15 frame but still the game Playable smooth but of course Okay, I'm going to close here So that is the PC and now as the second game I'm going to run is um, Mad Max Mad Max these games are actually high graphic games so okay I click already create shortcut <coughs> okay again I will show you the PC configuration here it is same i5 Here you can see the frames also. Okay. Minimum graphic on HD and need for speed most wanted. You can play emulator games. You can play. So for me, I think this this PC better than mini pc better than desktop and even you can play all the basic old games like five years six years seven years before i am putting on resume i will show the setting also so i'm making this detailed review the reason is if really someone want to buy it so they can get an idea how long it takes to loading this kind of games mad max or battlefield 5 is 2022 game Battle, Battlefield 5 is a demanding graphic game and it's 2022 game so I think I hope you can understand even this laptop still managed to play and what window I do is I do NT, uh, uh, LTS Windows 19 Enterprise uh, sorry Windows Windows 10 2019 Enterprise that window is only until 2029 support it's 2029 other all windows support is 2000 so here you can see 20 frame is running and the game still playable <coughs> so here is the Mad Max and you can see of course the graphic is not very not very high quality but still the purpose to showing you this still playable okay okay I'm closing this <coughs> so other there's a emulator games you can still play emulator games same like here I have like Street Fighter or Art of Fighting there's a lot of games you can play okay I have Street Fighter okay click on Street Fighter so you can see here even I don't remember the <clears throat> okay so okay <laughs> so that was just all that for 
so that was the my simple review for gaming for this laptop and you can do the video edit i can do like movie movie maker you can do the simple video editing on the 4k also you can do video editing i used to do it so basic all youtube and the, the everything can work very smooth like here is the google chrome and again i'm open the same time you can see many tabs here opera and let's connect the internet and <clears throat> here is a youtube okay you can see very fast and smooth working even i put here opera also you can see so many tabs on the opera is running so many tabs amazon here and it's working very smooth here is google chrome <coughs> yeah as you can see there is a two tabs google chrome and opera and there's so many tabs open and there's no lag no hang or anything just 8 gb ram it's quite smooth everything is work very smooth you can see i'm changing the tabs here and internet just connected so i will recommend this laptop really if you want budget laptop as a desktop you can just make it something like that yeah, <coughs> yeah. you can make next to your pc or you can hang to the wall or anywhere how i do it i'm using as a desktop and yeah that's fine perfect and even i don't close it i just put on the sleep most of the time and morning when i wake up i just uh, click on my mouse and it's turned on so thumbs up for that